Right then, hello, so welcome to part 4 of my Let's Play Rise of Nations campaign. So I'm playing as America and the British have decided to attack me, so I need to begin the defence. I don't need any cards, I should be able to win this with pure power. Because all I've got to do is hold out for 90 minutes. So even if they play better than me... Uh, and, oh, that's a bit annoying. I do have reinforcements though. So I've got an army. This is helpful. That means he can't just like attack me straight off the bat. So that's a big, big win. So he'll probably have to build a bit of an army and out what truck well try and out muscle me. Uh, right, where, where's my woodcutters gone? Right, you two. Yeah, all right for money. Get some economy. I've got loads of wood in this t in this one. I'll hit like what ninety. So I need to get this up to 100. There you go. Uh, I'll go for this next. Don't get that because that's food and wood. Uh, food and coin. Ah, oh, I've got my population limit as well. That's probably more important because of taxes and stuff. Uh, you build. Have I got a market? No, build a market. I need one. So I can trade that way. I can buy food if I need it. God. Ah, oh, okay, now I've got another army. Okay, I don't think I'll be able to, like, he won't be able to beat me now for a while. Because two armies will probably last, like, a good ten minutes. Yeah, because I'm winning in score as well. So he's probably, like, not even got a market yet. Uh, Sight of one. Right, you build me. I haven't played this for about a month. Right, build. Yeah, I've not uploaded anything for about what three weeks. Reason being, I've been moving house. Right, delete those. Uh, I can't do that yet. Well, that's fine. I should have probably built up first. This ain't going too well. I'm not doing this very well. This has been ropey. Let's just say that. That's fine, because that's just wood and gold. I've got wood. Because I accidentally probably went a bit too fast on wood to start with. So I've got wood. Wood is useful though, so I'll need to build farms in a minute. Now where's that settlement on? Here it is. Temple. Farm. Yes please. More reinforcements. I might actually be able to just get all my men to charge in and just win. Oh, it's a bit risky, isn't it? I could do. If I hadn't known I had about this many reinforcements and I hadn't just gone in straight in and attacked, probably would, I probably would have won.
Because quite early on, this many men I don't think it'd be able to be. Uh, I don't know where Britain are. This is the only problem. I knew where they were. That the strategy might work. I don't know where they are. They might be on an island somewhere. I don't actually need to win, I've just got to like not die. So I don't have to go like super aggressive. I'm just trying to like find them. Right, what have I got on food? 110. Get some science. Ugh, oh, damn. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. Oh, damn it. Right, get me, some, get me a market. Ah, good, site level 2. Okay, good, get that built. Oh, 36. Where's my... There you go, get that. That's what I need. That's actually important. They might accidentally just walk into the... Yeah, they did. Oh, I think I'm on an island. So I can't use my extra manpower. That's a bit annoying. Yeah, I'm on an island. Oh well. That means you can't attack me for a while because he's got to build boats. And they're quite costly if I remember. Right, everybody here. Uh, right, you go to the first town. Build me that, like, instantly. You build... that. And I need that. And now I need... Oh, I need more knowledge. Come on, come on. Got it! Okay, right, that's my third town now. I'm getting one scholar about every minute, so build that, because that will get me more. Uh, barracks are cheaper, yes, I need that. Get me two more scholars and then I'm about done with that. That's food and ward. That's fine. That'll be fine because that'll get me. I'm gonna need more economy. Two hundred and sixty dollars. Oh wow. Okay, that's a lot. Uh, right, you build me another city because that gets more gold. Remember, right? You protect that city. That's your job. And you lot. And you. Over there. Uh, yeah, fine. Yeah, fine. You attack. Use light over there. 
there. It's because I haven't got like loads of units like because it's just going around in circles, doing my head in. You go there. Yeah, right, you lads. For now. Right. Um. Let's build it there. They're a bit close to each other, but never mind. Good. Right, you build. Where's. Yeah. Yeah, I'll do. And then you have to build that, build that. This is probably going to be like my main wood area. Right, that's one problem dealt with. Right, yeah, fine. Right, okay. Job number two, get enough scholars. Build two of those. More tanks. Because I need it. Oh, requires level 3. 160. That won't take me that long. They'll probably shoot up in a minute, my ward, because they'll be like, oh, you have all this, like, you've got this new upgrade. The only thing I've not really focused on is, like, metal. Which is one thing, ah, oh, what's up now? Ah, oh, not again. Not enough metal? <laughs> what did I say? Oh. That was so fun. I was just saying I have done metal. Uh, anywhere got metal? I might have to build a metal town. Right, have I got anyone to bed? No. Okay. That's fine. Just for now. I don't need you. You come over here. gonna have to. <sighs> right, I've got the money. Right, youth, I'm gonna have to do something that I wouldn't normally do. Um Yeah fine, 168 is absolutely fine. How do I buy metal? Buy a hundred metal. That'll do. Right. Get this. Now, then I can build more people. This has been a bit sloppy. But, you know. Three hundred. Not enough wealth. Okay, fine. What's that? That's metal. I know I'm at the pop. Ah, okay. What do I need for that? Food and knowledge. Oh, actually, that's two things I've actually got. Okay, medieval age, here we go. Right, this has only took me about 15 minutes. I don't think that's too bad. I'm actually losing, but you know what? Points wise, it doesn't matter. I'll advance in a minute. And then I should go ahead. Yep.
Well, that makes Scarlet quite a lot better. So do him. Finish that Scholar, then do that. Because that makes him go from 5 to 7, so that's like a 40% improvement. That's quite a lot. Level 4, that's fine. Level 4, right. Everything requires level 4. The only thing I don't have put off is food. Oh, that's because I didn't build a thing here. Okay, that's fine. I'll fix that in like a minute. Right, build a smelter here. And then once you build that, go to this city and build a granary. Because I kind of forgot, that's probably why I'm not got this food. And then I need to probably go and build that there. Then you should go and build a smelter. That should fix a lot of the problems. Then you four need to go there. That should fix the problems. I'm 200 points behind, that doesn't worry me at this point. Not with him going around doing everything. That should single handedly like fix most of it. That's actually quite useful. What about this? Ah, oh, damn it, I should have known that earlier. Uh, right, okay. Mission. That's level four. Yes, okay, now we'll roll. Now we'll roll it. Because there's one down here somewhere saying it's built. Right, that's one problem fixed. Get that out, that'll put, fix another problem. Then get that. Okay, so, right. Knowledge is fixed. Money is okay. Metal. I think metal I'm fixing. Yeah, metal is going to be fixed in a minute because I've just built this. He's going to build. Is he going to build this now? Not sure. Where's he gone? Oh no, he's building the grainer next. Okay, so great. That'll fix food. We're rolling now. Now I've got level four. Oh, that's going to improve wood massively. And this is going to improve food massively. Okay, now I'm going to like just roll up this home. I'm going to put my army here. This might not be enough. Uh, I've not built any base protection. Right, get me a thing. And you. And you. Resources don't matter. He built an army quicker than I thought. I didn't think he'd attack until about another 10 minutes. Oh, this has really annoyed me. Okay, right, lads. I really need to get... Ah, oh, yes! God, right, get attrition. We've not lost yet. Caught me a bit off guard, but I've not lost yet. Get attrition level one and get attrition level two.
Right, if I get attrition level 1 and 2, this will help massively. Yes, okay. Do four of them. No idea what's going to have to do in it. What's he got? Longboatman. I think he's upgraded his units. Oh, I've got two lots of archers here. You use them, they can be a bit of a decoy. And then they can go in as well. Oh, my tower's kicking. Yes, attrition's kicking in. All right, we'll probably win now. So we've got attrition. Okay, this is good. This is basically why you have to. This is basically why attrition is overpowered. Tower do a bit of damage. Yes, I got one of it. Destroy that. That's the most important thing to destroy. I've got no cavalry, that's the only problem. Never mind. Yes, I think I've got it. We're about on our knees, but we are going to win, I think. Yeah, we'll win now. Because I've got better units in here, and I've got the uh, attrition advantage, so we'll be fine. Basically in the Dark Ages, up until like this age, attrition's actually quite effective. It's not until you get like rockets. Like even when you get rockets, I suppose it is it is effective. It's just different. Yeah, that, right, that's like level 2 attrition. The only thing I need to try is a bit of coin. Right. My food got a bit wrecked. Doesn't really matter. All right, build that. All right, that's fine. Wood is absolutely fine. Smelter is getting there. This town should be fine because it's got a barracks and two, B, it's got two towers. So what orders will build? I'll build three of them, two of them, and one of them. That's my defense team. That should be enough. Unless I get like an absolute massive army attack. But it'll buy me a little bit of time anyway. Not again. Oh no. Well, I've got my units have been improved this time. What I'm gonna have to start doing is building actual like towers up on the sea. Then if he attacks it won't matter. 
as well. Just like destroys boats before they get here. Right, you attack his archers, surely. How many events he got? He's actually doing better than I thought he would. Right, double the speed of that keep. We need that keep going up. It's a good thing I had all the reinforcements. Well, I didn't build an army. I should have built an army, really. I didn't build one. If I build one there, build one there, build one there, three keeps should keep them at bay. You know what, I'll build a fourth just in case. Four keeps should keep them at bay, because he struggled against like two earlier. So if I have four with an army, I can't see him beating that. He might, but it's going to need more firepower than what he did. Uh, Fine, get that. This is going so well at the start. We can come back from this, don't worry. This is just a minor setback. This was actually planned. What I wanted the English to do is get a bit comfortable and then I just like come back and win. This is actually deliberate. Get that next. Well, knowledge is not a problem. What two thousand knowledge? I've probably got enough knowledge to like rolling in now. So that's till the end of the game. Um, uh, right. What I need to do is go defensive tower and defensive tower. Now I've got two here, and then if he gets any boats in, he's got another two to like destroy afterwards. And I've got a bit of an army here. It's a variety army as well, so it should be fine. This is probably the weakest one. Oh yeah, this is weak. Yeah, I need some more firepower here. Uh, they're fine, but they can't make any more units. They've got quite good defense. Yeah, economy. I'm fixing the economy now. Don't worry. Then food's probably... Oh no, food's only on 220. 310. Oh wow, okay. I need, I need another town. Yeah, then you can build another one. I don't actually know how much food that will give me. So I'm going to have to wait until this is built and then see. Oh, that's 1,800. Oh, I was saying earlier, I had plenty of knowledge. I'm not paying 900. Uh, that town is probably fine. This town's probably not. Uh, 
this sounds fine. Right, and it's both stable. What's that put me up to 400? Okay, that's fine. Uh, I don't think anything actually requires that, so I might just build that. Yeah, let's get that. That's all tax. That's more money. That's fine. Well, mm, oh, hello. He's scouting. Boom, he's dead. So he'll probably attack this town next. We're actually about even on power. That's alright, I was behind. This is really like my metal town. That's my metal town. It's got a bit of food in it. I don't think I can improve it much more. Not really. So I've got to do this. Ninety might be enough for now. I might get away with three ninety. I need maximum food output, obviously, because food is important. Me uh, wood, I've got maximum output. Metal is not bad. Coin is three hundred and twelve. Actually helps. What is it on? 312. Let me build a market and a, then a temple and see what happens to gold. So if it stays, it might stay the same, I don't know. So I will be like that. That put it all by ten. Maybe a market does help then. Ooh, that's a lot of coin. That didn't change it, so those you don't need in every city. But those you do. That makes sense, okay. You build that, then build me that, then build me that, just in case he tries to attack on this. Docks, that's what I want. I want that, that, and that. I want three of those bad boys. Oh, and by the way, to protect them, I want a massive castle. Build it there. He's got a long, 
lot. He, he's got a lot to do, that guy. Poor guy. So we're all right now. Resources, we're fine. That's got green, that's got green, that other one's got green. Four and nine must be the most you can get on food with three towns. You need a fourth town. Which is a little bit annoying, but I'll be. Oh, have I finally overtaken him? Ships it, yes, I'm going to get that. Because that'll be quite useful for when they get to a big ship war with Britain. It's going to happen soon. Got to do now. Well, now knowledge doesn't really matter. I've done everything. Oh, green research cost it. Really? I didn't even see that. That's worth 60 food as well. I don't need it now, but. Uh, I saw the bison, but I thought it was just like, I forgot. I was thinking of Age of Empires where there's bison on the map and it's actually food, but I forgot you don't get this on here. That was my fault. I'm an idiot at times, never mind. Right, yo! There you go. This is gonna be like a big base. Might actually go on the offensive in a minute. I don't have to. Because Britain actually goes a card light, which when I don't get my advantage. So they've actually used quite an important card early on, so they kind of needed to win this. And so far they've not. They had a chance of winning, but they walked it up. Well, I had three reinforcements, so it wasn't really their fault. If I had the reinforcements, I would have lost something. But because I have reinforcements, I've like holded them off. Ah, oh, I should have turned my microphone off. Whoopsie, sorry. Uh. They're all cheap upgrades, so they can just like get research. Okay. They're probably really bad boats. So what does this do? Strong versus light ship, bombard ship, weak versus fire ship and submarine. So fight so what are they? They're Karak. They're strong versus so they're weak versus fire ships, they're strong versus fire ships. So what are fire ships good again?
Right, I've got a spare villager on mining for now. Won't harm to get more money. Right, so they're all heavy ships. They're good against light ships and the light. They're good. Against, so fight those fire ships are good against my carax and then these caravans are good against heavy ships. So I'm guessing heavy ships are good against light ships. So if he's got anti fire ships with arm, if he's got fire ships, I've already got four anti fire ships. Okay.